Australia Tele. Good morning to you, Jane. This information is coming from the South Korean military that uh, North Korea has just launched that ballistic missile. And just in the last minute or so, I'm reading new information that it was launched from the West Coast. Uh, it exploded within seconds. It was a ballistic missile and landed uh, in waters off Japan. Now, of course, uh, this uh, launch from Kim Jong-un this morning comes on the very same day that U.S. Secretary of State Rex Tillerson addressed the U.N. and called on the world community for urgent action against North Korea, saying that the world community needs to act before North Korea does or there could be catastrophic consequences. I've got to tell you, Jane, too, this is the eighth ballistic missile that Kim Jong-un has launched in Donald Trump's time in office. And as we know, uh, the White House has said in the past few days that all options are still on the table with regards to a response to North Korea. Of course, that means military action, too. So we wait now to see just exactly what the White House has to say about this latest uh, test missile launch today certainly uh, really does uh, ratchet up the tension between uh, North Korea and the US. Yeah, worrying times indeed. Laura Turner, thank you.